how to remove someone from an email thread in Outlook. If you're managing email groups in Outlook and need to remove someone from a specific group or email thread, you're in the right place. Let's break down the steps to make this process smooth and efficient. First, let's clarify that removing someone from an email thread isn't exactly about removing them from the thread itself, but rather from the contact group or the specific email you're sending. To remove a member from a contact group in Outlook, you need to access the group settings. Here's how you can do it. Open Outlook and navigate to the People section. This is where all your contacts and groups are stored. Select the group from which you want to remove a member. Once you've selected the group, you'll see an option to edit it. Click on the three dots or the Edit Contact option, depending on your Outlook version. This will open a pop-up window showing all the members of the group. Here, you can select the member you want to remove and click on the Remove Member option, usually found in the ribbon at the top. This action will remove the selected member from the group, but they will still remain in your people list. If you're looking to exclude a specific person from an email without removing them from the group permanently, the process is a bit different. In this case, you can't directly delete someone from the group for just one email, but you can manually adjust the recipients list when sending the email. When you add the contact group to the To field of your email, you can't directly edit the group members within the email. However, you can remove the group from the To field add the individual members manually, and then exclude the person you don't want to receive the email. This way, you're essentially creating a temporary list for that specific email without altering the original group. In summary, to remove someone from an email thread or group in Outlook, you either edit the contact group directly to remove a member permanently, or adjust the recipients list manually when sending a specific email to exclude someone temporarily. Both methods ensure you can manage your email groups and threads efficiently.